hi guys welcome back to my youtube channel welcome to today's video sorry i'm in the car but this is like the best place i can do this video right now because i really want to get it off my chest okay so first off let's take this let's take the sunglasses off <laughs> how are you guys doing welcome back to my channel welcome to today's video i mean this is one video that is just burning me up on the inside because right now the nigerian social media space is at gog with cheating scandals cheating rumors and then the question of should you suffer with a man should you not suffer with a man should you stay in a relationship and you know work it out with the man and all of that and that is really what i am going to be sharing today i'm going to be pretty much sharing my own perspective on this topic okay so pretty much that's what you know i want us to talk about today and i'm just sharing my own perspective on this particular subject because it seemed like um last week there was this competition between copy um real worry picking and her husband and people were like you're looking at real worry picking and the husband as a model but you're not looking at you le doce and the wife and then this week we have the trauma and the video issue and it is a whole mess at this point marriage literally doesn't even mean anything anything anymore commitment really doesn't mean anything anymore and i'm trying to share my own perspective on should you suffer with a man should you not suffer with a man so pretty much that's what we're going to be discussing today because i feel like just a week ago we were talking or comparing between how you should suffer with a, a man because of real worry pickings um wedding renewal vows and all of that and then people were comparing between real worry picking and you le doce and his wife and they were talking about you know who should be your role model or don't talk about real worry picking and forget um yule doche and then this week we are dealing with davido and the scandal multiple baby mamas popping out from every corner of the world and it literally just seems like right now marriage or commitment doesn't mean anything anymore as in it just it just screams is there even a need okay so pretty much in my own opinion suffering with a man is not the problem suffering um yeah suffering with a man is not the problem it, the problem is what you do with yourself why you are suffering with that man the problem is what you do with yourself why you are in that committed relationship marriage or whatever it is that you choose to call it that is really where the problem is because if you're talking about suffering with a man majority of the times the women give up their entire life to live their life for this man help his dreams be actualized help his dreams become physical for, um, realities and all of that stuff the woman Woman pretty much puts her life on hold and all she thinks about all she does at that point is for the man okay and usually what happens is that this man becomes a much better person a much better version of himself and he doesn't see the need for you in his life anymore he doesn't see how you fit into his new life his new world his new levels okay and let's be honest it's not just the men even for women this thing happens as well you know a man trains you through university and all of that stuff and then you come out after your university your youth service and you're like you know what i don't think i can settle for this village man anymore i don't think i want to marry this mechanic anymore and all of that the problem is not just um maybe you looking down on the person the problem is that truthfully those people did not put any form of effort into their lives while they were working on your own lives and as such it doesn't measure up anymore let's be honest the truth has to be said so so the problem is not whether you should suffer with a man or you should suffer with a woman and all of that and in this particular context of referring to men the problem is what do you do with your life what do you do with yourself while you are suffering with a man or suffering for a man how are you adding value to yourself because let's even break it down if you add value to yourself while you are suffering with that man if eventually he becomes this better version of himself and he says he doesn't want you anymore it will not hurt so bad wait it will hurt but it will not hurt as bad as you not being able to do anything for yourself 
because majority of the problem is stemming from you not having any identity not being anything at all and all you see is this partner is your alpha your omega he's your beginning he's your end he's everything he's going to be wealthy and come and make you okay he's going to be wealthy and give you this beautiful life you are not giving yourself any life you're not putting yourself first and as such nobody's going to put you first sister i am sorry but it's the honest truth okay that is where the problem is when it comes to should you suffer with a man should you not suffer with a man okay add some value to yourself why you are suffering with that man add some value to your life add something to yourself upgrade yourself as well okay do not let your life go just because you are suffering with a man which is where we are missing it that is where we are missing it a lot of the times these men will now go for women that even you cannot even stand in front of you can't stand in front of them and when you look at these women you're like oh my god i do not measure up the truth is there's nothing different between you and that woman the only difference is that that person puts some effort into their life they put some effort into themselves and they put themselves first so it is not should i suffer with a man should i not suffer with a man you can choose to suffer with a man okay you can choose to marry or be in a relationship because you absolutely love the person and all of that and you don't care about the financial implications and all of that and then you know carry on with that relationship but all i am saying is while you are doing that please add value to yourself do not become the one that can be trashed and thrown at the back when life gets better okay now that's for that as for the whole cheating <laughs> I've, I've read so many things in the last couple of days so many people saying they don't feel sorry for choma um she knew what she was getting herself into and all sorts the truth is that with my background in entertainment industry and having worked in a tv station i have seen firsthand what some of these desperate girls could do just to be in in the circle of a celebrity or just to be with a celebrity so i would say yes to some extent trauma knew what she was getting herself into but of course that is years of commitment to the video okay now i'm not going to advise her to leave that relationship or not to leave all of that is down to her but trust me a man that both of you lost a child and he doesn't feel the need to be responsible at that time he doesn't feel the need to be responsible at that time or at least for a period simply because of what you guys are going through but goes ahead to just you know do it with any and everybody i mean my sister put some respect to your name put some respect to yourself okay like let's let there be something about you that a man cannot toy with that a man cannot mess with add value to yourself sister add value to yourself in whatever situation that you find yourself in your relationship or in your marriage add value to yourself once you can add value to yourself trust me you will not be easily disposable okay also in your relationship make some stand stand your ground on certain things do you understand what i'm saying stand your ground on certain things just be like i can't take this i won't take this no matter what and all of this is stemming from you being able to give yourself power and add value to yourself because when you can add value to yourself you can stand your ground on certain things because you know what i don't really need him to do this for me i can do it for myself so financial empowerment is a must for every woman i mean if you earn your own money you can call the shots on certain things and men will take you seriously which is why lots of these men don't like to go for working class ladies in the first place they don't like it because you know that there is a certain confidence that these working class ladies have okay that you cannot just go and mess with your head you guys i needed to pour this whole out because it's just been so much in my head let me know what you guys think about this let me know what you think about suffering with a man or not suffering with a man staying in a cheating relationship pretty much just let me know and if there are trending g's that you want me to speak on or highlight on let me know as well you guys i needed to bring this out really really quick i'll see you all in my next video bye